Hey, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Ashley and I am a student who is navigating online schooling and I am temporarily unemployed thanks to COVID-19. Um, I already deal with anxiety, but a lot of this chaos has really um, triggered some extra anxiety and stress with the amount of uncertainty and confusion and that's why I need to use some tools to calm down sometimes. Today I want to help you calm down by teaching you a tool. Don't worry, you don't need to go grabbing supplies. All you need is your breath and your body. This breathing technique is called praying hands and if you're like me, you're probably rolling your eyes right now. If you don't usually practice breathing, it sounds silly or cliche, but there is science behind it. If you truly give it a try, you might actually find out that it helps. The point of this tool is to help fill your body with fresh oxygen. This should help you feel more clear and focused because it helps your body relax. Deep breathing also helps activate your vagus nerve and that helps your body feel calm. So I'm currently quarantining in a house with three other people and with the stay at home order, it can be a lot sometimes and it can really start to feel cramped. So my roommate and I really butted heads the other day and I feel pretty bad about it now. Um, honestly, it wasn't even over anything that mattered. It was pretty trivial and it really took my mindset to a bad place and it ruined my whole day. Um, I should have stepped out and used this tool to calm down so I could decide if that argument was really worth my energy and time. I probably could have had a really productive day, but instead I let that fight drag me down. In moments like these, your nervous system kicks in and your fight or flight instincts take over. But using breathing tools like praying hands can help make more rational decisions instead of ruining our whole day. All right, let's give it a try. In, even if you think this is some mumbo jumbo, please just give it a try, or if not, just skip to the end of the video and see my special feature. <laughs> make sure you're in a space that is quiet and calming so you can help your system reset or pause. You can do this while standing or sitting, whatever is more comfortable. And you're gonna be going with your hands in front of your chest, palms against each other like praying hands, hence the name. I'm going to talk you through the movement and then we can do it together. Inhale through your nose, move your hands up words while you feel your lungs fill with oxygen and pause at the top and really focus on that fresh full feeling. Then exhale through your mouth while you bring your hands back to center. Okay, let's do it together. I won't talk this time, but make sure you really feel your movement and the oxygen. Also, you can close your eyes if that helps you focus. All right, let's go one more time. Inhale. Nice, awesome. Take a second and see how you're feeling. And then when you're ready for the next one, we're gonna keep our hands in praying hands again, but rotate them forward. And instead of going up and away from our body, we're gonna go out and away from our body. Otherwise, same thing. Again, notice your belly when it fills up with that air. All right, ready? Let's give it a try. Awesome. And you can modify this tool however you need. Um, find out what works best for you and you can shift your focus into whatever part helps you calm the most. When I do it, I really focus on my palms pushing together with some force there and some pressure. And I focus on that connection moving away from my body and coming back too. But you might find something else helps you out. This awareness of how you're feeling is mindful movement and it's an important part of making these techniques actually effective. So the next time you're stressed out or your roommate is really sticking a thorn in your day. All right. Hands at your chest, inhale, pause, exhale, and outwards, inhale, exhale. And thanks for watching. I hope this video helps. Stay safe. Stay home, just know you're loved and you're not alone. Thanks. Also, if you wanna learn more about breathing techniques and how to heal from trauma with them, 
then head over to Irreducible Grace Foundation where they're posting weekly videos on breathing techniques.